हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम गाइड एंड दिस इज माय न्यू प्रोजेक्ट व्हीकल इंश्योरेंस सिस्टम मींस व्हीकल इंश्योरेंस मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम एंड आई हैव डेवलप्ड दिस प्रोजेक्ट इन पाइथन जैंगो एंड द माया स्क्वेयर एंड द वर्जन आई एम यूजिंग इज द पाइथन वर्जन 2.7 एंड द जैंगो वर्जन इज 1.11 एंड द डेटाबेस वर्जन मींस माया स्क्वेयर वर्जन इज 5.6 फॉर कनेक्टिंग द डेटाबेस विद द पाइथन आई एम यूजिंग द माया स्क्वेयर कनेक्टर which you will get easily from the mysql.org website and uh, uh, for front end technology i am using the html css and javascript some of the jquery library for <coughs> validating the form and uh, integrating the uh, date calendar on the date uh, <coughs> date components right so this is all about the technology so the project title is vehicle insurance system and uh, Uh, this is a mini project which has only and single user login that is the admin means admin can perform each and every operation there is no login for the customer there is no login for other users so this is a mini project because in mini project we provide only a single user role login that is the either the admin or the customer but this project has only and only admin functionality okay so so what you will learn from this project so if you get this project then you will learn uh, to create the login form as well as get the change password forms validating the login details from the database directly and the performing the crud application means create read update and delete operations on the <coughs> python django and the using the mysql so this you can uh, learn from this project also you will be able to learn that how can we integrate the data table in the python django <coughs> so let's start with the functionality so this is the home page of the project as you were seeing this is a very simple normal page and uh, this is not a bootstrap theme this is not a responsive theme this is a very simple html template right so uh, this is the home page of the project if you want to change the content then you can change the content from the uh, html page directly the second one is the about us page so this is also a static page and if you want to change the content you can change it from html this is the contact page so i am not saving the data of this contact page anywhere in the database so this is a normal page so you, you can say that home about and contact these three pages are the static page there is nothing dynamic in it right so next one is the admin login so this is the dynamic page means if you enter the login then it will be validated from the database and if you enter the invalid credential then you will not be able to log in right so this is the dynamic page so if you enter any of the credentials then it will not be able to log in so just i am entering the correct credential and this is the home uh, dashboard of the admin means what the admin can perform admin can add the new insurance admin can see the insurance details admin can change the password and admin can log out from the system so this <coughs> operations can admin perform and this is a mini project that's why uh, it has only a single module as well as the login module for login with the admin okay so the above the these uh, sections is also available here right so you can either jump on the page from here or clicking on the here right so one more thing i want to show you so this is the uh, dynamic menu so if you can see there are these menus are available but if you log out then the menu has been changed so this is a session driven menu so i log in and now i am going to add insurance so this is the add insurance space so you can see this is a very big form so what the uh, had you can enter the name vehicle number policy number nominee name insurance start date so if you click on yeah in date vehicle model rto city engine number chichis number payment date and the insurance amount yeah, customer so and also the image of the car or the vehicle which <coughs> which is getting insured right then these operation so if you fill this form then those details will be uh, saved into the database and uh, those details will be saved into the database wait and uh, you can see 
the details of the cars is uh, coming here right so you can see these are the car details and the name of the insurance name is from which insurance company that has been issued right then image and the details so right so <laughs> this is a list of the uh, insurance which you have added in the database right so one more thing uh, th this is the data table right means if you want to uh, sort the record then just click on that column that record will be sorted right so i am showing you this also the phone number is same for all so, right and if you want to edit the record just click on the edit and you will be able, you will be able to edit the record and update it <coughs> right okay so if you want to delete the record just click on the delete and those record will be deleted from the database so just click on the delete and those record will be deleted from the database right that record has been deleted from the database earlier there was 10 record now it's uh, it's only nine record available as this is the insurance report so this is all about the project so uh, because this is a mini project that's why it's a, it contains very less functionality so if you need major project just put uh, the functionality what you need in the project i will develop it also according to your requirements and uh, don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest projects thanks for watching the video thank you very much